Good morning. Welcome to Scale Award YouTube channel. In this video, I want to show you some answer for the question about the tooltip option inside WinCC SCADA system. So, someone asked the Hello SCADA World how to show some content when we place a cursor on object. Simply, I want to show IO address of motor when operator plays cursor on that. Hope you got my question. Of course, I have your question and I think uh, you need to make something in your SCADA system and using the tooltip option. Tooltip option is about the when you move your cursor on an object, you can display some text, some symbols, and if you use the touchpad, you can use also the gesture options. But right now, I will show you the tooltip option and how to place this with WinCC SCADA system. Okay, we have our runtime. Let's go to our graphic designer. And after we put some tooltip text, we should have some option inside. Okay, so we have the flow one object and inside stack, we have the tooltip text option. Okay, and now we can put some information. Let's say it will be flow one and it's analog, for example, 10. So after someone uh, move your cursor on this object, they will see the tooltip text. You can use also the different language tooltip text. So if you have the English, German, Chinese, Spanish languages, there you can use the different tooltip text. Okay, so let's go with to different object. Let's say this SVG object. I can say it will be aeration blower. Okay, and if someone wants to click the on off button, there is another tooltip text. And this tooltip text will be, hey operator, check something before you switch on this aeration blower. So we can say that before you switch on this check, for example, pressure. So after operator wants to click this, they will see some information. Okay, in WinCC runtime, you see that we have the aeration blower text. And after we go to on off, we have the operator before you switch on this check pressure. Of course, it's tooltip, it's manual text on our SCADA system, but you can make this more dynamically with Visual Basic Script or C action. But the basic, how to make the IO field, IO address in our SCADA system, it's only to fill up the tooltip text inside our graphic designer. You see, I have some wealth options and if you have this tooltip text, you can have your information for your operators. Okay, thanks for watching. See you in next week. Subscribe to this channel and bye.